We are back again here today. No money spent episode seven, and we have made some massive changes to the team in this run. Roberto Clemente has been unlocked, and we have completed the NL collection. No money spent this episode. Go over some of the tips and tricks I use to complete this collection. No money spent already. Well, let's give you an update on my team. My progress throughout a couple of things. And then, of course, we got to hop into rank seasons with Roberto to see how he does. First thing, of course, here we come to my collections. We can see we got that Kinley now. And of course, we have Roberto Clemente. He's looking pretty solid. 125 hitting attributes for both sides. 81 and 85 power. Gonna play really nicely when you get that parallel a little bit. He's gonna have elite defense out there in right field. An absolute cannon of an arm. 72 speed as well. Not gonna lie, I was really bad with the Clemente card last year. I'm hoping that this card coming out a little bit earlier in the game cycle this year means that I won't be as bad with him because I gotta do Clemente justice. I was so bad with him last year. Gotta turn that around this year. He's definitely gonna be a center point for my squad for some time. We'll take a look at the squad right here. What we got rolling on, a lot of changes. So Kurt Gibson's gonna slide into left field from us from that Dodgers collections. We're going to be rocking Acuna still in center field. Been one of my best players batting 353 with him so far. A lot of that mix between events and ranked seasons mainly. Batting 353. Obviously, we got Clemente out here in right field. Prince Fielder at first. Utley at second. Seager at shortstop. And now, new addition to the squad. I did upgrade third base. Talked about it in the last episode. Finally upgraded third base. We got Fernando Tazis Jr. here. The hitting attributes speak for themselves. That 60 fielding uh, secondary position at third base may not be a good idea at all, but we're going to find out. If he starts making a ton of errors, we'll have to make a switch. Probably go with Vladdy Jr. or somebody like that when I get my hands on him. But for now, hey, my man Tatis going to hold it on at third base. On the base, we got Trey Turner, Cattell Marte, Gary Carter, Soto, and Harper. I don't know about this Cattell Marte, by the way. If y'all need a card to hit lefties, platoon off the bench versus lefties, Get you could tell Marte, especially when he's playing inside edge. His inside edge is up versus lefties a lot as well. Or he gets that inside edge boost versus righties, and he really is a balanced hitter. Get you a could tell Marte, absolutely elite bench back and play every position as well. In the rotation, uh, we got the Grom, the supercharged Kershaw for right now. I don't know who will replace Kershaw after he's not supercharged. Maybe Walker Bueller or Brandon Woodruff on days they're playing up. They just rock with Alec Manoa for now as well. But we got supercharged Kershaw on the bump. Max Scherzer, Wheeler, Corbin Burns. Obviously, we added Kinley to the bullpen as well with this Kinley Jansen right here with that with that cutter slider sinker combo. 100 on the hits for 9, 115 on the case for 9. He's got good control as well. It will be sliding into the bullpen as well. The team is coming together up to a 91 overall team. Still have 66,000 stubs in the bank as well. I'm holding on to a couple investments as well big play i'm working on right now um we have 12 of this dodgers prospect i got these around 1700 stubs you can see he's already up to 2400 stubs but if we get a jackie program on friday and you got to get parallel progress with dodgers expect my man andy to skyrocket three four five six thousand stubs definitely possible so not a bad play maybe to pick up some other dodgers as well we saw some guys relatively cheap on the market kind of like will smith down quite a bit may not be a bad play of course you don't know what's coming friday but that is the case could be a good opportunity to snag some dodgers now before i hop into this game i want to talk a little bit about my strategy for completing this nl collection no money spent obviously as you can tell one the only teams i have completed are the nl teams i've put no focus on the al teams at all and the reason for that is i don't want to spread myself too thin i don't want to be completing some teams here some teams there and again i'm spreading myself too thin i'm not able to focus and knock out one thing at a time so what i do is one division for me i started with the nl east that was my very first division i completed i did nothing besides sell every single card outside of the nl east and then as soon as i had the stubs to complete the entire nl east in one go that is when i went ahead and locked in my cards doesn't really make sense to go through and let's say you lock in a bunch of marlins players but all of a sudden jesus aguilar has a three home run game and a 600 sub card gets supercharged and he's selling for three four thousand subs you might as well sell that and then be able to buy them back for that 600 sub so i would recommend not locking in your cards until you complete an entire division it'd be super enticing just to complete the cheaper teams 
one by one by one work your way up to the more expensive teams but that's kind of counterproductive because one those cheaper teams generally are only going to keep getting cheaper over time and two the more expensive teams generally keep getting more expensive over time not to mention as well i could play the nl east first not only do i get these cracked out nl east cards of course we also come in here and i get this chase utley you can see right now this chase utley is batting 385 for me with a 1200 ops this chase utley has been a key part of my team he's helping me win more in ranked in events that he's eligible in he'll help me out there he's helping me be overall more successful and therefore make more subs overall as well and then of course what i'm doing when i'm completing one division whether it's the central the east the west whatever it is i'm selling every other card in every other division if we come in here to the royals and you know i got some cards i haven't cleared out in some time but at this bobby witt card right here i was needing some stubs we can look in the marketplace he's selling for 533 stubs right now i could sell that card i could sell this bobby witt i could get that 500 subs i could utilize that to help me knock out more in the nl with whatever division i'm working with or vice versa and again when we come back and have to rebuy this bobby witt he's likely going to be a little bit more inexpensive especially at his price right now even if he got up to an 80 overall gold with a roster update he would be around 400 stubs because that's the quick sell value for golds so we're going to clear out everything in our inventory besides the division we're working on we're going to stockpile all those cards in that one division and then we're going to complete it in one foul swoop so again now that i'm done with nl all my nl duplicate cards those will be sold i'm probably going to start here with the al west i'm thinking knock that big boy out of the way early on and i want my man michael young on the squad as well so al west probably knock that out real quick start selling all my cards from the east and the central so i can full focus here on the west and stockpile those stubs as well with our with our uh selling out our inventory do not forget some of these little things as well, such as equipment. I mean, we can find, you know, example, I have this ritual right here. I can't sell it, but hey, 281 stubs right there. Do I have anything else in the inventory? I got two of these sunglasses, 83 stubs a piece. It's not much. It's not much, but it does add up over time. I got three of these shin guards here, 65 stubs a piece. It's a little bit tedious, but all those things do add up over time. Same with our perks as well. You got a diamond perk sitting here. Boom. 1200 stubs just like that so pay attention to our equipment our perks our sponsorships stadiums unlockables everything we're gonna full clear out the inventory sell everything i sold face of the franchise cards outside of Corey seager i kept that one but i sold five of my six sellable face of the franchise cards i sold i've sold every event reward i've obtained so far i sold every card i got from the br program we are gonna sell everything to fill our bankroll up pack these collections because once you get done with the live series collection the stubs just roll they keep rolling you got a cracked out squad the bankroll starts filling up a little bit you can start being a little bit more aggressive with your stubs make some investments you can sit on for a longer period of time those hit all of a sudden we have millions of stubs we can easily go back and buy those cars we sold at that one time and of course we mix all that in with a little bit of flipping here and there some overnight flipping things of that nature let's well, that bankroll is going to be rolling they got 67k stubs right now we're going to turn that into a couple hundred k stubs at a pretty rapid pace i feel confident with that want some more detail about what we've been doing to build up the squad this is nobody spent episode seven right now be sure to go back and watch the other six as i build up my squad through all those episodes i talk about in each one what i'm doing to make stubs what i'm doing to build the squad what is my uh, plan of attack and my approach during those given times so if you want to see how it's kind of progressing over time what kind of things i've been doing when i was starting out versus what i'm doing now be sure to check out the rest of those episodes in our No Money Spent series too. I think it'll be super beneficial for you as a No Money Spent player to help you build up your squad, attack collections, get a cracked out team. All No Money Spent here will be the show 22. At this point though, let's go ahead. Let's take Roberto Clemente. Let's hop into ranked seasons and let's see how we fare. If y'all remember last video, our ranked seasons did not go great. So we got a lot to make up to do. If y'all enjoy the video, definitely be sure to leave a like and subscribe supports the channel in a massive way and helps me continue to put out content like this let's go ahead let's hop into the game with this one um all right we're, we're gonna be on the road he's gonna have alec manoa who is poo poo dog water but he also has a cap which is not fun but that's okay that's okay that's okay it's not it's a good team but not crazy crazy oh okay yeah oh okay oh oh break it down roberto oh 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 okay okay yo my man my man roberto ready to play bro gg that's harambe and center is the gg bro it's no shot get down get down get in a gap better baby chase 
Atta baby, Chase Utley. Good start. Good start. Good start. All right, Clemente, first AB. Harambe on center field. I am terrified. Clemente. We sell. We immediately sell. Immediately sell. Advanced surrender, though, dude. Thoughts? Thoughts, 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 thoughts? Roberto Clemente, team player. No. We're scoring a run? Hey, hey. Fun middle baseball. Fun of middle baseball. That's fun of middle baseball, baby. I didn't know I had two strikes. Log it in. At the time of this recording, we are six and a half hours into a stream right now. Follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Ansel Armstrong. Thank you very much. All right, tie game. That's fine. Tie game. That's fine. Oh, it's fine. My man is just swinging. Dude, Kershaw does not have ELO. Oh my God, this was a mistake. He gone. Yo, we got him swinging though. Come on. Yep. Yep. You gonna learn today? Uh huh. Yeah. I gave you one. I gave you one back with that slider, but you gonna you gonna learn today? Get that play. Get make that play, Kersh. Make that play, Kersh. Let's get it, baby. Come on. Oh, get through the shift. Yo, run, Corey. Yo, you crushed it, Corey. It's all we ask. All we ask. No. Nope. All right, Kurt Gibson. Kurt Gibson, first AB. That's a double play. Dang it. He sold entirely. Oh, Deserved. Earned. Earned, not given. Earned. Earned, not given. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh my God. Dang it! Pop up pain. Up your own cause, Kirsch. What's good? Up your own cause, Kirsch. Imagine and one power. All right, one one mid second. Let's go. Chase, dang it! All right, lead off single here. Get him with the swing. Two down. Let's go. Get there. Let's get it. You can't leave on the pin's gonna be nasty with how many righties he's got. All right, top of the third. We gotta get the bats going. Number 26. Oh, mom off of it. Dang it, man. We're slightly off the ball right now. Get through. Oh, Clemente. A line drive into the glove. Dang it. That's a good piece of wood. Man. Ah, dude, we gotta find our approach at the play right now. 1-1. One, one. Start us off with an out that Tatis with absolutely no fielding. There it is. Come on, Tatis. There it is. Woo. Every, I'm not going to lie, every hit to Tatis is absolutely terrifying right now. Get there, Seeger. Get there, Seeger. Get there, Seeger. 56 speed. Come on. All right, fellas. That's got to be there. Ah, dude. That's ball four, man. That's 3-1. Um, I was early on it at least. Man, they were lost at the plate right now. We gotta find it. There it is. All right, Kershaw's dealing at least. I love that. I love what Kershaw's doing so far at minimum. One down here, bottom four. Let's get it. There it is. All right, top five. We gotta figure it out offensively right now. Just gotta, I got. I got. Slow it down. Slow it down a little bit. Find our groove. Find our rhythm. No. No, that's a walk. All right, that'd be Kurt. Come on, runner on first. Runner on first. 18 rubber to walk. Come on, baby. And this is why, right here, this is why we don't accept the friendly and only the show 22. JT in a gap. Come on, we run it, Kurt. We run it, Kurt. Let's go. Keep running. Keep running. That's scoring. You're scoring. You're scoring. You're scoring. You got to hustle, Kurt. You got to hustle, Kurt. You got to hustle, baby. He's safe. Two to one. Let's go. There it is. There it is. I mean, dashboard after a singular run. He said, nah, brother. I'm going to go ahead and head out, chief. I'm going to go ahead and head it on out, brother. Nah, now I'm hyped up. Nah, now I'm hyped up. Now, now you got me fired up a little bit. I want to keep playing. That was about to be a mercy rule.